Hey, what's happening everybody? I'm going to show you today if you have a brand new Android TV device and you try to go in the Play Store and get your Puffin TV browser that it's not working and then if you get Downloader that the browser there isn't a browser in the downloader either so I'm going to show you how to a couple ways how to fix that especially if you're new to Android TV or even devices so so just open up on Android TV just open up your Play Store and we're going to search we're going to do uh, Puffin caps locked you don't have to do caps and then just hit search and then puffin tv we'll go ahead and install it the latest update i don't know what if it's just not compatible with android uh, 9 let's go ahead and we'll open it up and it's a it's a great browser for android tv but as you can see we'll type in here We'll just do uh, HTTP colon forward slash forward slash get dot file linked dot com and then go ahead and search. Click that. go to start page and there's no downloads or nothing so if we go to Google it's just it's not it's not loading up anything There's no, there's no bra. Oh, there we go. So down here, we'll type in a file linked. We'll hit go. Click on this first one, and then we'll go down here and we'll say download file linked. And it's it'll pop up. Download is not supported on this device. So I don't. I don't understand what they're trying to do here but the last update for Puffin TV it just I mean any any URL that you put in there it just it won't it won't it won't download So we'll go back to the Play Store, and then in here we're going to put in, just type in down, and then hit search, and then grab downloader. We're going to install that. We're going to open it up. We'll allow it. Hit OK. And then if you go into the browser here, there's the page you're t there's no browser if you go into settings you can't enable JavaScript or nothing now if you're familiar with file linked you can if you hit home it does allow you to do file linked but if you're just trying to get a uh, APK or just type in a URL it will say browser not supported or uh, not supported on this device but you can get file linked so just type in get file link dot com and then uh, allow install from it delete the downloaded APK then just go ahead and hit go 
and now you can install file linked but I'll, I'm going to show you how to get the browser for downloader just in case you don't want to use file linked but I'm, I'll give you my file link code but here's what I want you to type in here a uh, downloader to get JavaScript and uh, enable your browser so you, you'll erase that get dial, dot file link dot com HTTP colon forward slash forward slash then you're going to type in browser dot AFTB news dot com then you're going to hit go all right now we're going to install this downloader browser plugin install we're going to hit done now you're going to delete that download and now when we go over here uh, we don't need to install it again delete that plugin now when we go here you go to settings and now we have enable JavaScript so we'll enable that click yes and now we have a uh, now we have a browser so now you'll be able to install anything So now you have now you have your Google Now you have your browser but also now any any URL that you type in here will work I don't have a I don't have a URL to try So anyway we got file link now but and also we, we have downloader so now your downloader will, will function properly so now let's go back into the play store and let's go to my apps let's uninstall our puffin TV because that's useless and now we're gonna go over to our settings and let's go auto updates let's yours are gonna be on shut them off okay so now we're gonna hit our home button and let's open up that file linked and let's type in six four zero six six zero two two and we're gonna hit continue and this is my store here and I keep these uh, older versions of these browsers I don't keep them up to date guys because they they update and they break so I know these are working on my Android TV and they work good so I have you know APK times a good store I don't really like Aptoid, but Google Chrome, EUMC is an awesome player, uh, Firefox, this version works great, and then here's a Puffin TV. I love Puffin TV on Android TV because you can use your D-pad, it has a built-in mouse toggle, and, and it, it just works slick. I got lots of other things in here too, so I, I try to keep it somewhat, but I'm, I'm really busy, but I try to keep it somewhat updated on things so just try them out and but media centers here uh, some miscellaneous goodies uh, movie AP, APKs movie and TV show APKs And most of those movie and TV show APKs, I keep the originals, so even if they're outdated, just install it, and it'll ask you to install, update in the app. Um, some popular players. And my tools section. 
So just you're welcome to have a thumb through and just you know grab things if you want. I just thumbing through here just for the the new people that are coming to Android TV. I'm just showing you a, a quick way to get going with your device setup because they're making it really tough just by going in the in the Play Store and grabbing the couple things unless you know how to use file managers and, and stuff like that but th this is a simple way to get Puffin TV on your device and to use downloader and like I said if you don't want to use file link that I showed you how to get the plugin for downloader to where you can get other other things and use a browser and downloader but Puffin TV download hit that download arrow next to whatever you want hit the download arrow after it downloads it turns into a play icon hit that same icon for install then install and you might have to enable unknown sources in the settings before you're able to install anything on Android I think 8 and above you have to enable unknown sources on each app that you want to install from so I'm just gonna hit done I'm gonna hit my back I'll hit yes and now I'm gonna hit my home button and now we can add you can add downloader and you can add Puffin TV now both of these you'll be able to browse and do whatever you want with just so now we can go to the search and now you'll be able to, to HTTP colon forward slash forward slash and I'm just using file linked as a URL example you might have a different URL for an APK that you want or something and it don't work so this is just I'm showing you how to make it work and then once it starts downloading now if you exit this and, and reopen it there will be a downloads column and then you just click click on it settings allow that click on it again and now you can install see before we do it wouldn't pull up this downloads page and then same thing if you go to Google you'll be able to see how it has that built-in mouse toggle and then you can just use the on-screen keyboard here so if you didn't have a built-in keyboard or if you didn't have a mini keyboard then you can just use your remote and use the mouse toggle click on it click on download file linked once you see that start downloading you just hit your back button Oh, where is it at? Oops. What? Hit your. I don't have a back button on my keyboard. Let me grab my remote. hit your back button and then you'll go to start page and then you'll have a downloads column where all your downloads go then you just click on them here for install install hit your settings to allow unknown sources and you're good to go but you don't like I said if you're if you don't want file link this is just a way to show you how to get going on your Android TV device because they make it impossible just by using Puffin TV so you gotta get that old one from my file linked or use downloader and install the downloader plugin 
but the main thing is if you do use Puffin TV go in your Google Play Store settings auto updates and shut that off so your Puffin TV doesn't update and if you if you would like go ahead and grab a couple browsers from my file link G grab anything you want from my file link alright that's enough of me hopefully this helps you guys get started if you're if you're using a brand new uh, Android TV and don't know how to get anything because the Play Store is making it real difficult right now so there you go. Alright, love you guys. Peace out and happy streaming.